National Jiao Tong University. I'm glad to be here and uh, introduce the variation of fan cup creator of healthy people in game. In the past few years, some of research presenting the human get is hybrid capability and uniqueness. And some of the research presenting the human get is uh, reliable for individual, individual recognition in computer version field, such as the model free method and model best method. But we want to observe some detail of the thing. This the logical parameters in gate. So according to our previous study, this figure shows the uh, kinematic data in such top plan of lower limb joints. And uh, you can see the solid line that means the 20 tri uh, 35 trials in uh, with one each subject and the solid line is the standard deviation. And this figure shows on your left side that uh, we can set, uh, we can observe the the 30, 35 trials in each subject is uh, is high repeatability. And some figures shows on your right side the solid line is the uh, the five trial of all subjects, 10 subjects, and it's a mean value. And the uh, next line is a standard deviation. And we can observe uh, uh, five trial is, uh, uh, is similar, and the uh, standard deviation is within a similar range. And uh, it's the solid line is overlapping. So we think. Uh, the, we observe some variation between subjects. So we're trying to use the self-organizing map neural network to take uh, to analyze the data. This table shows we use the 64 neurons to collect the data. So we can find no matter we use the kinematic data or kinetic kinetics data for data classification, we can get high recognition rates. So we think uh, there should be another important features such as planetar pressure is very important. And uh, some of the research uh, trying to observe, uh, uh, trying to concern the normal subject or uh, but normal subjects that they concern about their difference. And some of res such as the, some of uh, research presented the normal the differences between a normal subject and diaphase or normal and opposite gate. So we trying to we're trying to find out some differences between normal subjects, not the patients and the, the normal subjects. So in our method, we're trying to, uh, uh, there were, I'm sorry, I'm so nervous. There were 10 female subjects in our study, and they were asked to wear the gong fu shoes because we want to fix the issues plant temperature measurement system sensor to fix it on their foot. And that that then feel negative negative foot. And they were asked to walk thirty twelve and it's level walking and uh, they was walk walk on, along a walkway and at a natural speed. And then we try to use the uh, in-shoes plant temperature measurement sy uh, system to record connect area, fragile time integral, and peak pressure, depth of contact, and the instant 
of peak pressure. And uh, each, uh, each parameter, we will record A values. Uh, uh, if the value will record in different regions, such as the one, two, three, four, five, uh, the five region will include metatarsal third, four, and fifth. And six, seven region will include the toy second to the five. And the eight value is the total food. This is one region. Then uh, we try to use the self organizing map neural network networks to be our algorithm because this method uh, is can cluster itself. So we trying to use the training data. Try, we trying to use the twenty trials for training data and ten trials for testing data. And uh, then we try uh, we comp uh, we compare the, the training data and testing data to calculate the recognition rate. And we calculate the uh, recognition rate is numbers of trial in testing data and in a correct classification divided by trials, uh, numbers of trials in testing data. We define if the classification of testing data is the same with the classification in training data we will define the trial is in a correct correct classification. Yeah. So then I will introduce our result. This figure shows the when we use the different numbers of neurons we calculate the recognition rates. And you can see that uh, if we want to uh, if we use the connect area the red bar so when use the 36 neurons or don't shake <laughs> and 49 and 64 and 81 and 100 we can see when we use the connect area we can get the highest recognition rate then we try to calculate the calculate the different numbers of neurons recognition rate we also can get the high recognition. Uh, sorry, we can get uh, we can get the connect area can cause the high recognition rate. And uh, we trying to use the uh, SPSS version 17 to analyze and use the one-way ANOVA to analyze. We can get the p-value is smaller than 0.01. So we're trying to combine the top three features to data classification. So this figure shows the uh, combined case and or top three features is for data classification in separately. So we can sorry. Um, we can observe when we use the case A. Case A is uh, combined con contact area and peak pressure. And it can cause the 91 percentage re recognition rates. And we can find in all case, no matter, uh, no matter the numbers, the recognition, uh, sorry, numbers of neurons, we can get to the highest recognition rates are case D. Case D is combined the top three features, including the connect area, pick pressure, and pressure time interval. And then we try to, we still try to, uh, to calculate the mean value of the recognition rate with the numbers, different numbers of neurons. And uh, we still find the same situation and connect, uh, when we use a case A connect area and pick pressure and the uh, CASD connect, uh, sorry, combine three features can cause the high recognition where right? we can see it in this figure. Then it's our conclusion. 
So we can find a better recognition rate uh, of time. And when three variables such as the counting area, peak pressure, and pressure time interval are used as a feature of human recognition. And then, so we think the plant high pressure is available and it can be applied to researches in biometrics or computer versions. Thank you, everyone. It's my presentation. If you have any questions? Any questions? Just give a comment. Okay. Uh, can you copy your slide when you say your <coughs> two very small, okay. small zero point one? Yeah. Okay. Never do this. Okay. You never know the p value before you run the test. You say you are alpha value, or you say your significance to point okay. zero one. You know what I mean? P value is set out. Right. So I put my alpha value set at what level? 是在 ten percent 的 level 还是 five percent 的 level？ 很多学生都会犯这个错。Yeah, you I set the alpha. Yeah, I set the alpha value to ten percent. You was ten percent? No, five percent. If you as a five percent is a two tail or is one tail, 你要说明清楚。Okay. 你是 one way ANOVA， 所以你要说明你是 one way one tail 或 two tail。Two tail. Two tail. P 怎么会是零点零？ Right. You have two tail. Each tail is yeah, yeah, is five percent. Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, everyone will make this mistake. My students are the same. Okay. Yeah. So maybe questions. Yeah. 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 Like a, so, so, but I don't know is whether it was successful, but the, the, it's interesting you use some pattern recognition to distinguish yes. some different gate patterns, right? Yes. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you.